find the lcm of 60 and 68 to find the lcm first we should frame it in this way 60 comma 68 this is your step 1 now you should focus on to the first number which is 60 here for this number last digit 0 so directly take 5 first number 6 a number close to 6 in 5 table is 5 ones 5 6 minus 5 1 1 carried forward 10 when do we get 10 in 5 table 5 to 10 the other number 68 last digit is neither 0 nor 5 so this is not divisible by 5 so we write it down as it is now here we have 12 12 is 2 6 12 the other number 68 last digit 8 e1 so this is divisible by 2 first number 6 when do we get 6 in 2 table 2 3 6 the other number 8 when do we get 8 in 2 table 2 4 8 now here we have 6 6 is 2 3 6 the other number 34 last digit 4 e1 so this is divisible by 2 first number 3 a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2 1 2 3 2 1 1, 1, 1 carried forward 14 when do we get 14 in 2 table 2 7 14 Now here we have three. Three is a prime number, so three ones three. The other number seventeen not divisible by three, so you write it down as it is. Now we got one here, so focus on to the other number seventeen. Seventeen is a prime number, so seventeen ones seventeen. So we got one in both the places. So our LCM is. LCM is the product of these numbers. That is five into two into two into three into seventeen. When we multiply these numbers, we get one zero two zero is our LCM.